Hello and welcome to a very very exciting video. I've recently got into Charlotte Tilbury and I have a very addictive personality so when I'm into something I am obsessed. So like I'll be watching YouTube videos, uh, scrolling on the website, constantly like thinking about it. Um, so the other day I was on the, um, I think it was, I was on Instagram or something and I saw that Charlotte Tilbury was bringing out a mystery box and I was like Oh, I don't know if I can justify it. It's like £140. But then I just went for it because I needed a treat. And yep, I can legitimise treats all the time. So, yeah. So it came in a box and then the mystery box came like this. I have opened the box that the box came in because I wanted to have a look, little look at those things but the rest of it I haven't opened so I shall show you all of the freebie bits I got and then I shall start opening the box I'm so excited so the first thing I got was the magic cream I love this magic cream it's so good but basically whenever I can get an opportunity to buy the samples or get the samples I'm going to do that because um, when I go on holiday I don't want to take the container because it's quite heavy and I just thought if I have a load of the samples it will be better and actually it'll keep the cream fresher in my head that makes sense um, so yeah love that stuff and actually the sample you get quite a bit like on in that one I think you can usually get about two uses out of it the second thing I have got is the goddess cleansing ritual um, I tried this the other day when I brought some stuff from Charlotte Tilbury and I really liked it like my skin felt so clean so like there's two steps there's the yellow one which kind of removes your makeup and like just kind of takes off that bare that kind of surface level stuff and then the charcoal really kind of goes deeper into your skin and really pulls out all those impurities and your skin feels so refreshed afterwards so I'm really really happy about that okay then because I spent over a certain amount on the mystery box I got um, two mini lipsticks and one full size lipstick so the full size lipstick was Charlotte Tilbury Lucky Diamonds and this is um, I think it's in Pillow Talk yes mm, Pillow Talk <laughs> Diamonds um, and this is basically just like I think this is more of like a topper um, but it's got like sparkles and um, I probably won't be able to show it is it going to focus mm, yeah ish <laughs> so that'll be really pretty I think I'll probably wear it as a topper oh I've got to focus I'm back um but you know I love pillow talk I have quite a lot of the range and it's just such a nice color and like I've got yeah far too many then the little lipsticks I have got are the Viva La Vergara and they're just I love these like baby lipsticks they're just so cute um so if I can get it out not doing very well here and it comes in this like leopard print I believe it's leopard print um me and my friend were talking about this the other day the difference between a tiger and a leopard and this is a leopard because it's got like the I don't really know how to describe it but I think it's leopard print and um, this colour is oh, it's quite dark again okay, let's see yay um so this is probably like an evening one so I'm kind of glad it's a small size because I probably won't get through a full size but how cute and diddy love it okay then the final sample was the hot lips can I see what it is oh in Patsy Red um so let's hear the look skis oh and this one is like a Christmas red that I will be saving for Christmas I do like reds but I don't really wear them that often so I'm glad it's in a small size because I just don't get through um, a lot of red because I don't think it suits my lips because I have quite small lips I just think it makes them look smaller so I tend to save those purely for Christmas okay now is the time for the actual box I'm so excited I love the like tissue paper like it's just so luxuriously wrapped oh I'm so excited it's like Christmas day so I'm gonna open this up wow 
it, there's a lot of tissue paper. My teaching side of me is like, oh, this will make good for school. <laughs> Whoa. There is so many products. That's insane. Wow, I can totally see why this was 140. It's like 50% off. Okay, so I'll start with the ones that I knew I was getting. So the first one is Wonder Glow. Now I have had one, I have got Wonder Glow, but I kind of use it every day, so it's not too much of a problem that I've got a duplicate of it because it'll, I'll just save it as a spare. And it is very luxurious looking and it's just like a very glowy primer I don't tend to put it on my nose because my nose is quite oily and porous I guess is the word and I don't feel like that kind of deals with it but for the rest of my face I really like it so I tend to just put two um, a primer on my nose and then um, that's targeted at pore filling and then this on the rest of my face and it just looks so lovely just like your makeup sits beautifully on it okay then the next thing that I knew I was getting was the legendary lashes volume 2 now the mascaras get quite a kind of mixed bag of reviews like some people say they're really good some people say they aren't um, so I'm looking forward to trying it out I think this is the one that tends to get all right reviews I think it's the volume one or volume yeah volume one that doesn't get the good reviews that was great uh, the, <laughs> the good reviews I couldn't speak them um, and obviously it's very Charlotte Tilbury with the eyes and the rose gold which is just totally my aesthetic and I love it so I'm looking forward to trying that let me have a little look at the one actually um, Oh, that made a satisfying noise. So yeah, it's quite a, um, I don't really know how to describe it, like it's got quite a lot of uh, bristles, um, it looks quite chunky, which is good because I've only got small eyes, so I think this could work really well. The only bit I'm concerned about is the flaking, but we'll have to give it a whirl. Okay, the rest of this stuff is now a complete surprise. Um, so I've got another uh, Hot Lips lipstick and this is in Angel Alessandra. I love the packaging, I just need to look at how to open this. Ooh, it's a push-up. I've never seen packaging like this. Oh my gosh. This is like proper bougie lipstick. Oh, that is insane. Like I feel like the camera won't justify how nice it is. It's quite heavy so I don't think I'd take this on holiday. But it's got panthers on it. It's got the Charlotte Tilbury and oh, the design is just beautiful. See, I don't want to break opening it. Oh and that's such a nice nudie shade. That is totally my colour. And um, that's like a colour I would wear every day. So that is lovely. I am very happy with that. Oh, that's just going to look so nice. It's going to be one I won't want to use because it looks too nice on my vanity case. So, vanity case on my vanity. Um, so yeah. Eee! Oh my gosh. The next thing is the Film Star Bronze and Glow. I have seen this loads of times and I've been really tempted but I think after I brought the bronze I was like I can't really justify getting this. So this is like destiny that I've got this. Oh, I'm so happy. The packaging as well so like you pull that out there pull that out <laughs> this is insane like this is just so ridiculously charlotte it's amazing oh, look at that that is so so pretty um the only thing i kind of observe is the shade like obviously for my skin this is brilliant but because this is in the fair medium but if you've got darker skin they didn't ask us for our shade. Maybe Charlotte Tilbury next time needs to put, you can put your shade in. Because I'd be a bit annoyed if like I got the dark one because that wouldn't go with my skin. So you know, on the flip side, if this is not your shade, then I would be a bit annoyed as well. But anyway, I'm really, oh, gosh, I can't open it. <laughs> it's so beautiful. I just, it's one of those I won't want to touch, but like it'll be brilliant for sculpting, so I can use the bronzer and the sculpt. Um, 
but yeah I'm definitely going to leave, write an email and about the shade range because that doesn't make me very comfortable that they've not covered all skin tones I just think that's you know especially you know more than ever at the moment we're aware of things it's not an excuse to not have the right shades but I'll deal with that off camera <laughs> okay the next thing um I'm just like a giddy child I'm like oh I don't know what to go for next <gasps> what Oh, I've wanted this for ages and like I put it off because it, it was like £22 and like I can't really justify that for one eyeshadow. It's the Eyes to Memorise in Rose Gold. Now, I have literally today just finished off my Stila Glitter, you know the little doe foot ones. Um, so this literally has come at perfect timing. Um, so let's have a look. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. So this is in rose gold, the packaging again is beautiful, it's so luxurious and yes that is what you pay for and that is why this is a treat. Um, oh, that looks so perfect, like I'm not going to swatch it because I don't want to touch it. <laughs> it's going to be one of those that I'll like have for ages before I touch it because I'm like I don't want to ruin it, it looks so good. Um, okay. The next thing is the Colour Chameleon. I think these are the eyeshadow pencils. Um, okay, let's have a look, skis. It doesn't say the shade. Oh, Amber Haze. I think that's a dark one, so it might not be great for mine, but yeah, Amber Haze for brown eyes. I mean, I do occasionally wear brown, so it's not. Um, I am going to use it, but. I haven't got brown eyes so maybe they need to kind of like check people's details but anyway that's really nice um, you can't really see it so I'm not going to show it but yeah it's like a nice light goldeny brown because I think the whole theme of this is like glow so um, yeah it's nice it's nice but I'd rather have had something like the um, this is a champagne coloured one and that's lovely. Okay, the next thing is the Hollywood Beauty Glow. Beauty Light Wand and Wonder Glow Primer. So we've got some bought Wonder Glow Primer. But that's fine because I use it all the time and it's really not a problem and actually it might be nice for when I travel to have a smaller size. So that's the Wonder Glow. I'm not going to show it too much because it's the same as what I've already shown. <laughs> But this I'm mega excited about. I have wanted one of these again for a while and I've kind of been like, oh. Um, and this is in Spotlight. So this is like quite a white toned highlighter which is really good for my skin tone. And um, I think this actually looks quite pretty on everybody. Like it just has this really lovely glow um, and it's quite universal. But yeah like sometimes i find that on darker skin tones some of the uh ones look really lovely whereas like on my skin tone like sometimes it just looks too much um but this one i think is quite universal so top marks for this one on um skin tone but yeah i'm really excited i'm not gonna like use it because i want to save it but it's got like this doe for applicator um, and on and off switch. I do know that you have to make sure it's on the off side or it'll just leak. But I am so excited for using that. It's just going to be such a pretty colour. Okay, two more items. Oh, I'm totally getting another mystery box when they do them again. This is just such a good pick me up. <laughs> okay, so this is a chic to chic in ecstasy. I think I really like this. I've seen this one and this was one I was mulling over as well as the pillow talk. I can never open these. Oops, there we go. Okay, I see what people mean by the boob looking. It has a, quite a resemblance to a boob, but you know. It is really nice and basically the idea behind this is the outer side. I'm trying to cover my mirror. Outer side you kind of put on and then this is like a pop shade so you just like 
pop it on your cheek um so yeah it's, this looks really pretty it's got um a bit of a shimmer to it which is nice um i do like a little bit of shimmer so i'm really looking forward to using this um i think i'll get a lot of use out of it but i do see what they mean about the boobage it does look like a boob oh well could, could look worse and then the final product is the hollywood lips instant glamour in a tube so it's a liquid lipstick i have kind of gone off liquid lipsticks um i just find them very drying but i've never tried charlotte tilbury so this one might be fine um but yeah i just i don't like when my lips feel dry after about two hours of having it on or like you go out and it's just like splodgy so I'll, i'm excited to try it whoa that's a red um shade is this in oh, I can't read CS green siren um yeah it's very red um I think I'd rather have had this in like a lighter shade just because like I said earlier I don't really wear um red like just because it just doesn't suit me apart from Christmas so I'll save this one for Christmas and give it a whirl then um but yeah that's really nice so for me for me personally the kind of the the duds of the box i guess was the um eye pencil because it's for brown eyes but again i can get loads of use out of this it's not a problem and this i'd rather have had a lighter shade especially as i've had the mini bullet um but you know it's fine the rest of the box i'm really really happy with um the my favorite although it's not my favorite at the same time is this bronze and glow um i'm really happy to have it but i do think they should have asked for people's shade range and that doesn't sit right with me um so i will be contacting them to you know say that they should be kind of including shade ranges um so yeah that's the only bit i'm kind of it just doesn't sit right with me but personally i'm going to use it so i feel really bad um but yeah but the other stuff i'm really really happy with i'm so happy with the eyes to memorize mem memorize mesmerize um i just think this is such a lovely show and the beauty wand so yeah i am really impressed i think that is such good value for money like i've done charlotte tilbury shops where i brought three items and it's been over 150 so to get all of this and you know there is an element of risk you don't know whether you're going to like some of the things but i think you know minus a couple of bets i'm really 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 pleased with it so i'm really looking forward to trying all of these on and yeah thank you for watching please press the like button and subscribe down below and i shall see you all really soon bye